That paddle gives me so much grief sometimes. Howdy folks and welcome to Hirschberg's Miracle Homestead. I am Martha. I have a pumpkin pound cake in the oven and I'm going to put this together so it's ready to go in when that comes out. And what am I making this time? Dorothy's going to be on the sidelines coaching me because I've never made it before. It's a baked oatmeal and it's sugar free. So we will go across the ingredients and then we will get started. So the ingredients we'll need are the butter, unsweetened almond milk, gentle sweet, room temperature eggs, Himalayan salt, baking powder, ground cinnamon, and oats. And this is the quick oats because that's what we had on hand. You can use rolled oats just as well. All right, without any further ado, we'll get started. The gentle sweet. What is gentle sweet? And I will let Dorothy tell you about it. Isn't she sweet to put this together for me tonight yet? <laughs> I was going to do it. She offered it, and I said, well, okay, go right ahead. Okay. What are sisters for? <laughs> <laughs> oh, here, just a minute. Oh, you're the main spokes lady on this. Gentle Sweet is a product from Trim Healthy Mama, and it uses the erythritol and stevia blend. It is xylitol free. We don't like to have xylitol sweetener in here because um, that is poisonous for dogs. And we don't want to take a chance with any of our dogs getting a hold of something that would be harmful for, for them. Amen. So um, we just keep it out of the house. <laughs> okay, the butter, we need to melt it. So I will pop that in the microwave. Put it in a little microwave dish here. Okay, the butter is melted and ready to go when I am ready for it. We'll let it there. Directions are to beat four eggs. So we'll start out with the eggs. So beat four eggs. A gentle sweet sweetener. Dorothy warned me that it's powdery and will puff up. Unsweetened almond milk. And now the butter. That paddle gives me so much grief sometimes. How am I going to pour my butter in there? There you go. That'll work. Now I'll trade out here. But I wouldn't be working at a different angle with the mixer than normal. Working around the paddle would be different, but yeah, if I'm not filming, then that's at a different angle. Okay, give this a mix. Give the bottom a scrape. Now we'll mix we'll mix the dry ingredients together before we add it to here. So here's the ground cinnamon, baking powder and Himalayan salt. So we'll give these a toss together. Oh, Dorothy said any any kind of sea salt would do. Alright, I 
am going to use a little measuring cup like this to dump it in. We'll start out with a mixer and end up doing it by hand. So you combine these two. All right, let's give that a go. And I think the rest of it I can dump in now. So we're going to finish mixing it with a wooden spoon. Okay, with a wooden spoon we're going to get in here and finish mixing it up. Alright, I think we're about home with this. About ready to put this in the pan. This is a 9 by 13 pan, and for this, since it's staying in the pan, I just sprayed it with Pam, so I wouldn't worry about flouring it. So we will dump it in. And of course, you want to spread it out even. This is ready for the oven, folks. It bakes it on 350 for 50 minutes. Here it is. The oatmeal's out of the oven. We could have added nuts to it, which would have brought it up to another level. Here's a slice of it, and it's good with a dollop of yogurt on top. But Dorothy prefers it with frozen blueberries and milk. Raisins are also good. Thanks for joining us today. We appreciate our subscribers. And now we invite you to stay tuned for The Golden Thought. Hi, I am Martha, and we welcome you to The Golden Thought of this episode. We are the twins, Marvin and Martha. Marvin is our very special brother. He's better known as Buddy. The Golden Thought for today. Just because you are not making progress as fast as you think you should, it doesn't mean that you aren't making progress. Keep going. And we know a turtle goes along very slow. And you think it's not making hardly any progress. You come back an hour later and you can see it made progress. Even though it's a slow go. The turtle didn't give up. He kept going. So just because you're not making progress as fast as you think you should, it doesn't mean you aren't making progress. Just keep on going. We thank you for joining us today. We hope you've been blessed, encouraged, and inspired. And with that, we'll bring this episode to a close. Thank you and God bless.